probably D here. And moving to designated position. Welcome to another episode of XCOM 2. Rolling. Now this mission is a must-win mission. Not that they uh, any of the other ones aren't. But the reason I'm saying that is because the avatar meter is full once again. And uh, Good copy. Moving on target. if we lose, if we fail on this mission, uh, it could be very disastrous. As in game over kind of stuff. Now, the reason I decided to record this because I haven't been recording all the missions because I don't have a following really move, move, and move. nobody watches and it's very time consuming to make a video and uh, like I say nobody's watching I need her for high ground is there any high ground opportunities here I don't see any okay that's kind of crappy but uh, let's get her over here anyway like I was saying I, without having a following and a lot of people watching, um, I just don't, um, I'm just not recording all the missions, just the key ones. And um, this one is a key one because like I say, if we lose, this could be game over. And um, now in the last mission, we killed one, the Viper King. And I should have been recording that because that's key. Uh, once you do Bradford's mission, you know, where uh, he has, um, um, where you go into the, the cave where Dr. Valen was doing those experiments on, um, we've got a hostile squad here. Aha, uh -huh, on all the, the different uh, creatures there genetically altering a, a berserker and a, uh, um, A berserker, a viper, and uh, Affirmative. an archon. Affirmative. Those genetically altered creatures, uh, which are very powerful, super powerful, are released into the game, and you're having to deal with them. From then on, is there? A, oh, there is high ground. Let's get her over there. Let's see if we can get her over here. Rolling out safely. Anyway, we eliminated the Viper King on the last one, and I wasn't recording on the move. because I wasn't expecting it to show up, and I should have been, you oh, know, because once you do that mission, they show up, man. All right, and and so I should have been recording. Is what I'm trying to say. Let's see if we let's kick this thing off. Um, she actually has good shots, even without being on high ground. But if I get her up here, uh, she'll have uh, better opportunities. I think. Is there some cover right there for her? Oh, come on. I want to see if the, yeah, if she gets up there, at least she'll have some cover. So let's get her behind at least some cover. That's a free move. It doesn't affect um, anything. So I think what we'll do is have her take the codex out and put the rest of these guys on Overwatch is that is that a good idea? Yeah, let's kick it off like this. Got it covered. Overwatch. Um, I'm not gonna put her on Overwatch. I might need her slash ability there. Scanning. And let us kick this thing off. Anyway, what was I saying? Okay, let's hope the Overwatchers uh, take the other two out. Pretty 
nice. That armor's tough. You know that was good. Down. That was really good, actually. Okay, so what I was, what was I saying? Oh, we got the snake. We got the snake. Um. On Overwatch. And uh, I don't want to move her up just yet. I hear a sectopod stomping around, and I don't want to kick him off. Uh, while we're in these positions, I mean, I could move her up here and then she kicks it off and she doesn't have anybody on overwatch to uh, protect her, so we won't move her. Um, we got the Viper King down, man, yeah, I, and, I, and, and so that um, Ready to go. made it so that overwatch. I'm just going to reload everybody right now. So that made it so we don't have to face that guy for a third time, overwatch. and it was really pretty cool. You didn't shoot, huh? Let's move you up. Whatever you say. Affirmative. Covering now. So we won't have to face it a third time. And um, let's reload her, because she doesn't have anything to shoot at anyway. Let's rock. Moving to Overwatch. And so now on this one, I can handle that. I want to record it because. Like I said, the meter's full. Rock and roll. And if we don't get this, I'm not sure if I want to come in from this side or not. Uh, there's some cover up there, just not a lot. You hear that? What the heck is that? I don't like that sound. Let's stay put. Got it covered. Aha! Oh! There's the other boss! This was the other reason I wanted to do this! Dang it! Oh lord, look at all the health on this bad boy. So now, every move that we make, it gets to take a move. So we have to decide what move we want to make. Now, we need to get rid of some of its armor before she can do it, before I let her shoot. Fortunately, we're far enough back that I don't think it can do too much damage. However, what, what does he have? He has a frost bomb. We can actually freeze it for a turn. Uh, can he reach anybody? Yes, he can reach this dude. Okay, so let's, let's freeze him for a turn. He just loses one move when we do this, but that might be enough to keep him from getting to our soldier there. Anyway, the cool thing about the Viper was, man, I wasn't expecting it, and it showed up on a time. It was a timed mission, man. Um... Saturated. Should take some of the armor off of that thing. Yes. Now it gets to, to, to move. Oh, it's still frozen. I like that. With some of that armor done. Let's do her free shot. Anyway, the cool thing about the Viper was it takes five more out. Oh, she has chain shot. This is a sniper with chain shot. If the first one hits, she gets a second one, and it does 12 to 16 damage. Let's go chain shot. The first one has to hit for her to get the second one, though. She got it. Only did six because of the armor. But she gets another shot. It's seven. Now, if we get its health, if we beat it up enough, it will run. And only have these two left. Now, she can do run and gun but that puts her in real bad trouble 
Um, real bad trouble. Um, she has an acid bomb. If that hits, oh, great. This will do recurring damage to it. Unless it's immune to acid. Let's find out. And then I'll finish talking about the Viper. Good, it's not. Is it immune to it or not? That thing is pissed. We gotta keep clear of that knob. He's burning. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. Okay, now we need to make sure. Ah, this guy's next right here, huh? Oh no, and she's the only one who can move. Uh, if she goes run and gun, she might have a chance to hit it. I just don't know that. I think on the run and gun, as soon as she runs, it moves. So I'm just going to put her on Overwatch. And that acid continues to burn. We need him to get hurt enough that he wants to leave do anything because of the acid the acid limits his movement he got another one so we have two stunned all right we need to get rid of this now this now rye guy has rupture this will uh, make it so that everybody else who hits him after rupture will do additional damage. Don't, don't miss, buddy. He executed it! Oh my gosh! I wanted to say, oh my god, but I was being nice. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. I'd love to ask Valen what exactly she planned on doing with this thing. I would be curious to hear her reasoning. Although I would question whether reason was ever involved in this decision. That was unbelievable! Unbelievable! He has execution. He has a repeater on his rifle. And, and that combined with the rupture, I guess, was enough to execute this thing and totally wipe it out the first time we made it. How? Wow! Wow! I mean, really, Wow! I, 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 I killed it on the first encounter with it, you guys. That's incredible. Anyway. So that was cool. I'm trying to finish up about the Viper King that we killed on the last one. So now the only one left is going to be... Locked and loaded. Um... The Archon, the one that flies, and he's the hardest one. I would love to get him executed like we just did with this one. Now we got two people stunned, is that right? Oh, he's off of being stunned. But he is missing. Boy, he got hurt. He, he really got hurt out there. This guy is still stunned. We need to revive that guy. Um, Seems doable. Somehow, this one recovered more quickly from being stunned. Can we get two of them? Where's the other one? There were two of these guys. I didn't see where the other one went. Did you? I was talking. I should be focusing on this. But uh, we'll get to the Viper King here in a minute. I I'm excited. That was so dang fortunate. He's cussing at us over there in his, uh, his language, I guess. Um, and we still have a sectopod stomping around. I can hear it. Boy, if she could get a shot. Is she the last one to act? No, she can go. Uh, she can't really get into cover. 
uh, for after her shot, though, is the problem. Well, we're going to gun her just to get her up closer. She's got cover here. She will not have much of a shot because of the range, and she has a shotgun. Yeah, but if she goes up here, she might. I'll take the high road. Nice. She should have a shot. Not only does she have a shot, she has two because this is a free throw at the trooper in the back. Let's take out the captain for a guaranteed hit and kill. And then she has a 75% chance of hitting this with her shotgun. Let's try it. Oh! <laughs> Everything's going my way. I tell you what, that is very fortunate. We're playing on Legend. We're playing on the hardest difficulty, guys. So um, I'm really surprised that uh, it's going as well as it is, to be honest. No problem, boss. A lot of a lot of things going our way. What I want is that he he can, can does he have revive? Does he have the ability to revive? I think he does. Let's get him over here. So we can revive that guy on the next turn. And let's get her back down in, 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 into, some, into some cover here. Without getting her out too far. Heading out. Anyway, the, the Viper. Let's, let's get that finished. Try to get my story Heading. finished here. Overwatch. Uh, the Viper... Showed up, surprised the heck out of me. Let's do this. We had taken Follow enough me. health out of it that it wanted to call in its, um, can you, he can only heal, stabilize, and heal, so he cannot revive. The only one who has revive is the one that's unconscious. Well, here, heal this guy Don't up. Move. You'll be all right. Anyway, so the last attack on the thing, and it, it had uh, damaged a, a few of my people, I'm on it. Um, was I'm on with a ranger. That was the only thing I had to attack with. And the ranger hits it with its sword, and I knew the ranger wouldn't have enough. Why can't he stabilize? Med kit. So we can't do anything to help that other dude. On your order. So we're just going to have to go with five for the rest of this. But I'm not complaining. I mean, my goodness, we had extreme uh, good luck. Anyway, so the ranger hits the snake, right? And I knew it wouldn't be enough to kill it. But I figured, you know, with the ranger being that close to it. I'm on it. When the thing tried to move, then um, the ranger would have a, a swing with its sword, you know, and, and could and could do it in, take out the last couple of points of health. But when the ranger hit the snake, the Viper King, he lit it on fire. On Overwatch. Huh? Yeah. Pretty cool, huh? Lit it on fire. On Overwatch. And um, I'm going to get them all together over here. I probably want to go to the other side, but uh, we're kind of doing it on this Damn side, it. it looks like. Come get some. And so Pick the snake up. only had like two two pieces of health left. Two, two, little, two little parts of life left, right? Got it covered. I'm on it. So of course it was going to disappear, but the fire did its work, man. I'm not seeing them. The fire took the last, you know, we had that, we had the snake's hair on fire. I know snakes don't have hair, but we lit him on fire, and his, his hair was burning, and boy, when that sucker went out, he went out. The, the fire did the trick, man. It, it got the last two bits of health out of the snake, the Viper King, and that was the end of the Viper King, and that's the end of that story. I just wanted to, I couldn't get my story finished because we had so much action. <laughs> okay, 
I'm going to stop recording for a minute here and focus. Because <laughs> I'm just sitting here telling stories about the Viper King. And I'm really excited about what just happened. You don't know how epic that was unless you've played this game. And you know how incredible it is to do that. Uh, so got very, very lucky because that soldier had uh, execute. He had the repeater on his, uh, on his weapon along with rupture. And boom, we executed the, uh, the Berserker King. Anyway, I'm, uh, I'm going to stop recording for a second and uh, focus on the job at hand. I'll be right back. Give me a second to think. All right, I think we have to make our move here. Um, how many have we killed? Um, we killed three in the beginning and then two, right? We got the captain and the um, advanced trooper. The Berserker Queen doesn't count, so that's five, and there were 11 to begin with on this map, so that means there is six more, plus reinforcements, and we only have a squad of five. Well, I thought that would kick it off for sure. Ah, here we go. And, um... Affirmative. Covering now. Move him up a bit. That's a really risky spot if they come. He's wide open. Can she get to there? I think I would rather have him there. I'm not going to move anybody else up on this turn because I've got a purse. I've got a couple of people um, exposed. Too exposed. I'm on it. Enemies on the move. So we're gonna have to pick up and carry the guy. This is the only guy that has revive ability is this guy. So he the only one who can revive him is him, and he's unconscious. We're gonna actually have to carry him out of here. Is the thing. Let's get um let's get him up here. So we have both our heavies up close. It still isn't coming. Overwatch. Well, I need him in cover. Now he goes on Overwatch immediately after moving. So this will probably kick it up. Stepping off. It didn't. I'm surprised. She can get to there. That will definitely. On Overwatch. Um, I don't know that I like her where she is. I'd like to get her in closer. Um, she's kind of far back. Um, she'll be hanging out in the open up here. But, Orders confirmed. I think she's far, far enough back that none of the bad guys will be able to shoot at her. Let's get her in Absolutely. cover. Overwatch. Movement is close. Still nothing. Amazing. Got it covered. Anyway, so we're going to have to carry this dude out. Uh, we're going to have to come back and pick him up. I'll probably use a sniper for that. She, when she comes down, she's going to have to pick, pick him up and carry him down in here. Um, well, we got to get this started. This should do it. And now. Come on now. Got some magic Yes, here. it did. Okay. So, oops. You know there's at least six. There's three of them right there. So there'll be three more after these. Oh, Lord. We're going to stay back. That's going to suck. Okay, what we want to do here is if we can kill that thing, it'll blow up and do serious damage to the others. Now this will take off three points of his armor. This will mark him and make him easier to hit for the others. So we'll go with this. We'll also strip off some of that armor. Shit, Nass! 
God grief, 85% chance. But he's marked. I can't believe she missed. So he's got 100% and this will take that armor off that I'm worried about. Okay. Now we can use his rupture again, and wouldn't that be awesome if he executed this one? That would just be awesome. Now rupture at 12. But it also means everybody else that hits him after this will do 33% more damage. Not quite enough. She's the last to move because our other dude it's unconscious. Can she get up here? She can. Good. This will kill that thing. On hopefully, what I want to do now, once she kills it. Oh. Okay. <laughs> she becomes untouchable. Because, uh, uh, wait a minute. Why can't she see the thing? One. Uh, uh, because after a kill. Uh, she's untouchable for the first shot. The first shot will miss her, uh, but then the second shot can get her. Um, could hit her. Um, we need to blow this thing to hell. Um, let's bring her down here. Well, she has run and gun, which means she can get anywhere within that yellow. Problem is we have a turret there and a turret there. Uh, so I think the best place for her is down here. And then she should be able to kill that thing. Become untouchable for the first shot against her. do a bunch of damage to the other guy. And she did damage to the other guy. Okay. That was the best I could do with that, I think. And he's going to put extra sh shielding on everybody. Oh, no. Oh, good. He missed. That was close. And it missed, because he's in full cover. All right. Let's see if he can disable one of these. I'll see what I can do. He can. 50% chance to take control of it. That would be nice, but it's a 50-50. Let's go with the sh almost sure thing at 99%. Oh, we could have gone and taken control of it. Way to go, Rye Guy. Rye Guy is being a stud on this mission. At least we got that thing knocked out for two turns. Now... And she, she can't kill that thing because of all the shielding on it. Um, but, oh, he's the last one to act. Oh dear. Well, um, let's take the shielding off of him and then she can kill it, right? Don't bother running. Oh, he killed it! Way to go! Oh, she can't. She has a turn. I thought he was the last to act. 
No problem, boss. Not working on this thing, at least. We can eliminate it on the next go round. Quite hit hard enough to, to take it out, but we still it's still stunned. So next turn. Hard target, minimal damage. If she runs and guns and gets in here, she'll kick up the other three. I don't want that. I do want to pick up this. Sure Oh good, a superior auto. Oh good, good. We got good loot. Good loot here. Yeah. Target asset recovered. Now she can still run and gun and blow that guy to hell, but she can't kill him because of all that armor. So let's get her back in cover. On my way. Draw him out. What's he gonna shoot at? Rye guy? That's the third time you missed Rye Guy. Rye Guy is just being stellar right now. Good to go. We can end that. But we have another way to end that. What I want him to do then is take the shielding off of this guy. There we go. Now, he still has a rocket left. 82%, let's get rid of that. Hopefully she hits 82, she did. Good job. Target eliminated. Now there's still another one up there. She can she can run a gun and flank him, but I don't think she can hit hard enough with all that shielding. So um oh good, she has a she has a grenade. Where's that other turret? I put her over here. Is that going to put her in jeopardy of being hit by that turret? Let's leave her where she is and just take off some of that armor on him. Get ready for a surprise. You're near the target position. I just hesitate to bring her in here because I don't want her to kick up the last three and then have her vulnerable after her move, you know? But, so I think if she just comes to here... Not a problem. She be all right. And kill... Makes her untouchable for a turn. That's right. So what I want her to do on the next Ready move. Come get some. Yeah, there's the reinforcements are coming. Menace one five, be advised, we've picked up hostile reinforcements inbound on your position. Plus, there's still three more our other bad guys. What I want her to do is plant the X4. Oh, she can't do it. She's one move short. Oh. 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 oh man. We just have to wait for the next turn, I guess. Uh, I just don't want to run her in there and kick up those other three and then she's exposed. You see what I'm saying? Um, uh, 
Let's take care of these guys. Scanning. Can he get up here? Did we blow that? We blew up the roof. If he can't get up on it, I guess we blew up the roof. On the move. On Overwatch. It's killing time. I'm going. Moving to Overwatch. Oh yeah. Affirmative. Covering now. Got it covered. Let's see if we can take the, the reinforcements out, then we'll uh, deal with the X4 charges and get the hell out of here. Guys should just get boys. Hi, welcome to the party, boys. How you doing? You doing okay? I hope everybody's having a good day. Oh, your day's not going so good. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, it didn't go go all that great. Well, we're all right. We're just fine. Hello. How are you? Scan him. That's the one I'm really worried about right back there. Can she hit that with her pistol? This one, a free shot. She has a free shot. She missed it. But. Not good. She can do shadow fall for a guaranteed hit, and then she goes invisible. Or. She, let's shoot at both of them here. Both. That works. Multiple targets neutralized. All right. Menace one five. We're not picking up any additional contacts near the AO. Proceed to plant the X four charges and move to evac. Who knows how long they've been keeping these storage units running down here. So there wasn't uh, three more down there. I mean to deal with. Oh, uh, we got to pick this dude up back here. Okay. Come get some. Um. Gonna have to pick him up. Location confirmed. Carry him out. Moving to Overwatch. Well, let's get the uh, X4 planted. Wow! <laughs> this went really well, actually. Menace one five. Status confirmed. X4 charges are armed. Move to the extraction point for immediate evac. Okay, let's get this out here. Where he's there. He's got to carry him out. Let's get it. Let's plant this. Here? What happened? What, what what happened? I did something wrong. What 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 happened? Why? Come on. There we go. <laughs> the buttons weren't working. Alright, we need to carry him out. Requesting emergency evac! I'm all over it. She took a weird way to get there, all right. No, she couldn't go through the wall, huh? Okay, pick him up. If we don't pick him up, we lose he, him and all of his gear. Let's go. Uh, and then you have to do a rescue mission to... Uh, and God knows when you're going to get that to get him back. So now we've got him and all his gear. You don't have to worry about it. Stepping 
Getting it done. Getting it done. You go, girl, you go. I'm out of here. Just a fantastic uh, um, mission, other than that one. Seems doable. The couple of guys that got wounded. Um, but hey, considering, all things considering, uh, it turned out really good. I mean, um, better than it. Sure better than I could have dreamed actually uh, getting that thing killed on the in. first encounter with it my goodness the berserker queen is dead you see if anybody Minus got promoted look at that confirmed. joint well, we blew the hell out of it even without the X4 Whew, 23 uh, turns taken that's in the red up there because that was like because I was being cautious and sitting back on overwatch trying to draw them out it worked pretty well look at right guy right guy is a hero excuse me I got hiccups right guy just did phenomenal a phenomenal job by our specialist Ryan right guy right See if he got a promotion. He deserves a promotion for that. He didn't get one, but Nitro did. And one is wounded uh, for five days, and uh, Vargas Syndrome is uh, only out for two days. So we can give her Salvo, which means firing her grenade does not end her turn. Or we can give her Hail of Bullets. Now the way she's built down here is all on a heavy gunner. She has chain shot, she has holo targeting, suppression, shredder, all of that. Uh, hail of bullets is the is the best way to go on here. I have other um, heavies that have salvo. This is really good too, but we didn't build her that way. We'll go with hail of bullets. It's a guaranteed hit, no matter what kind of cover the person, the uh, enemy is in. The enemy could, she could have a 27% chance of hitting it, but if you use hail of bullets, it's a 100% guaranteed hit. So we're going that way with her. And uh, let's go. Now, right guy has nine missions. He has 24 kills and nine missions. Um, Jackal over there, if you see uh, Jackal, the second one from the right, she has 142 kills. And 35 missions. That's our star uh, ranger out there. Having recovered another of Dr. Valen's modified alien test subjects, we should begin an autopsy as soon as possible. By following her own research notes, it is my hope that we will uncover the true purpose of her work. And once we get this guy uh, researched, autopsied, uh, you get an awesome, awesome uh, set of armor. Your team did a commendable job in destroying the aliens facility, Commander. Their efforts towards the Avatar project will undoubtedly be set back by your incursion. And the meter was full. So this should uh, give us <laughs> a little more time now and we can keep playing. It would have been game over if we didn't, if we failed that. See the meter up there now? It's, it's still one tick away from being but thank you for watching I know nobody's watching but you should be watching this is good stuff man anyway once I get a following I'm gonna leave these videos up. somebody's gonna I'm gonna leave them up somebody's gonna discover me and I, who knows and maybe I'll figure out how to make good videos and watch this and think it was really cool uh, thanks for watching we'll see you on the next one